I found some flyer my first year teaching at Mac when I was still 22. That was for a youth apprenticeship and I qualified for the age range. And so I just, yeah, I wanna go learn new disciplines. Had a great time doing the youth apprenticeship, but didn't see any of my kids in here. Um, when I would tell them what I was doing, they'd be like, oh, I think I've, I've seen that place, right? And they live right around here. So that was really where the idea kind of came up. My students deserve a well-rounded educational experience. And so grounding some of the theory around engineering and even manufacturing that they have at school with fun, hands-on activities here is what they deserve. The Crucible McClymans program essentially is for students between freshman and senior year. We are providing the opportunity for those students to come and take arts classes during the regular school day. The AIG application was coming around, so I used that as an opportunity to start a shop program at Mac, as well as connect that shop program to coming to the Crucible. The Arts Incentive Grant is a three-year program that allows for OESD-based schools to connect with arts organizations in order to provide resources, programming that they might otherwise not have on campus. I never knew what the Crucible was. I just heard field trip, getting out to school, I was like, let's do it. Clayton is somebody who cares very deeply about the well-being of his students and his community. None of the things that happened between McClymans and the Crucible would have been possible without his hard work. Mr. Evans is one of the best teachers I ever, 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 ever met. He was like the first teacher that would go the extra mile to make sure that you understand when I look at the projects I made from the Crucible, I have memories of being with people that support me. Students are able to come with their friends and experience something new. And because they're able to share those experiences across different departments with some hands-on learning, they get really excited. I've got kids pounding on my door to like, Yo, Evans, when are we going back to the Crucible, man? Like, they're um, eager, I'll say that. I'm very grateful that he told me about this and I actually had the opportunity to do this in high school. I wouldn't be the person I am today and I'm very blessed that I had him as a teacher. I want to see every student in McClymans have an opportunity to do a workshop at the Crucible and I'd like in five to ten years to see a few students who went to Mac working in the studio. I'm also looking forward to the ways that our partnership can be a model and expand to other schools. You're here because you know the power of what art can do. We're making an ask because there's still barriers preventing my students and other people from accessing the incredible resources that are here at the Crucible. Supporting the Crucible not only means that you're supporting people like Clayton, folks who are from the Climans coming to take classes with us, but you're also helping just create that space for tons of students learn that they have different opportunities outside of school available to them.